Hi guys, today's topic is about how to line up properly. I can tell you out of my experience coaching and also my experience as a player, um, the lining up is to 95%, a pretty big number I would say, always a little bit in a closed position. What does it mean? It means the right-handers are always having the body and the feet um, standing a little bit right of the, of the target line. And what does it mean for the club face? So if, you're, if your stance and your body is to the right or closed, the club face is also pointing, certainly not to the target line. So what is happening, or let's put it this way, first is the question, why is it like that? Because it's such a high number and it's, it's crazy. If you watch other people there, they're really standing far right and all of a sudden, you know, they, they pull the ball back in. Of course, they need to come over the top. And um, why is it happening that you're mostly standing to the right? To be honest, I don't know 100%, but I guess it, that most of the people put the feet, the shoulders, and the hip line, the whole body towards the target line, like onto the target. So that means my body is standing onto the target. But what you have to remember, and you can see it from this angle better, so you have a target line of the ball, you actually need to stand parallel to that. So if you stand parallel, if I put down my club now, and this is a little bit far right now, like this, yeah, but that's not far off. But I want to have my stance, my feet, my body, my shoulders a tiny bit open or not open. It w wants to be left. You know, the, the picture needs to be, I need to be a little bit left of the target line. It's not much at all. But for those people who really think they are on target and actually standing to the right, they have to have the feeling, whoa, I'm standing way far open. It's a mind fuck, I would say, you know, but you have to believe that. And, you know, I'm just talking as a coach here. I can see it from my, my students. They're having a square mat in my hut and the trackman is measuring a way outside swing plane, right? So they're really crossing over. They're pulling the ball back to the left or maybe they're pulling it and then slicing back. And then we're working on the swing and it's actually going to get better and better and back on plane. And all of a sudden they go out on the course and again, they're the aiming is bad, so now they hit the ball straighter, so they're ending up always to the right. What do they do? They are actually, they're actually starting the, ba the bad habits again. So they show up the next lesson and say, well, I don't know why it's coming back again. And I say, well, you know, the first thing is to practice the line up or lining up. And as I mentioned before, the club face, and I'm always going to repeat that over and over again, club face is king. The club face needs to point to the target line. If you want to have a straight shot, you want to have the club face pointing towards the target line and then the setup is going to be parallel. For me, for instance, I need to get myself a little bit more upright again and check my stance. This is how I can see it a little bit better. I'm also struggling a little bit because everybody thinks professionals, they always do it by nature. No, it's, it's hard work to get there. Um, but I always have to pay attention where my feet are standing, where my body is standing, because then, of course, my body and my club will also react and the good shot will not follow for, for sure. So I'm gonna show you now how the procedure will help you or what procedure will help you to get on, on a line better, on a correct line. So again, out of my experience, what, do the, what does the normal golfer do? Grip the club, get a stance, put the club down. That's the wrong order. So, you know, now the stance is taken, the body's in a position you, you don't want to change anymore. Maybe you're dancing a little bit on the spot, trying to correct, but you don't correct anything anymore. What you got to do is club face first. So put the right foot first, open the butt, open the hip, butt back, butt, butt away from the goal, uh, from the target line. And now, you know, now you just really get the club face and now you're taking your stance. And then, of course, you can waggle, you can look at your feet again. But this is a miracle, I tell you that. I've watched it so many times. Once you change that order, people have much better alignment. 
in the from the first from the first place on just try it out and now we're actually at that point where you really have to try it out get yourself some alignment sticks practice with that on the driving range pay attention to your alignment on the course ask your wife ask your buddies your husband well the husbands are sometimes a bit difficult but you know just really ask someone who's playing with you they should just check where you're standing at and sometimes if you're by yourself put a, a clap down go away again and just see how it is right get this checked and I promise you then your swing will fall back into a better place as well so if you like that content put a thumbs up to that video subscribe this channel of course if you would like to know more about me just follow me on Instagram as well and now I wish you all the best have fun practicing and I see you soon